All right, former President Trump is back in the battleground state of Georgia for a private high-profile fundraiser today in Atlanta. All of this comes as the former president tries to define his position on the very big campaign issue of abortion. He says the decision should be left up to the states, but that is getting pushed back from some of his biggest supporters. Mark Meredith is live in Atlanta with the very latest on all of this for us. Hi, Mark. Sandra, good afternoon to you. The former president is at that fundraiser right now, expected to rake in a couple million dollars for his campaign. There's been a lot of questions about whether or not the Republicans could catch up to Democrats with a cash advantage. The former president said today he believes that they are heading in that direction. But you bring up abortion, which, of course, has been the dominant story in the last 24 hours after the Arizona Supreme Court ruled that laws that date back to the 1800s governing when and, who, when and where an abortion could happen in Arizona whether or not that could stand the court ruling that they believe they could go back to those laws. The former president, when he touched on here in Atlanta, we had a chance to ask him whether or not he thinks Arizona went too far. He says he does think that Arizona is going to have to change its abortion laws, given some of those, uh, given the Supreme Court's ruling that essentially there will have to be changes made. But there's been that big question about how Trump would handle this situation because just this week, Sandra, the former president said he believes the abortion issue should be handled on a state-by-state -state basis. He says it's going to be up to the will of the people, that essentially if the folks in California want one thing or the legislature, that it may necessarily be different than Alabama. Obviously, that's playing out in real time where you have different states enacting different policies. But what's interesting, of course, is Arizona being a battleground state. Even the Senate candidate, the uh, former news anchor Carrie Lake, has come out to say that she, too, disagrees with this ruling. So Republicans here having to say that they believe the Arizona law was simply going too far. Now, how big of an issue is abortion going to be this November? We still have to wait to find out. You've got the economy, you've got immigration still polling higher from the latest Fox News survey, which shows what Americans are caring about. The former president today, he also talked about the latest economic report from the feds, which shows that inflation is still here. It is still happening right now. So we'll be looking to see, Sandra, whether or not he brings it up on the trail further. We know the former president's going to be down in Florida at the end of this week with the Speaker of the House trying to show that united front from Republicans. But, Sandra, right now, today is all about money. And I mentioned to John okay. before the break. Trump's first stop here in uh, Georgia was a Chick-fil-A, 30 right. milkshakes, which I guess while you're in Georgia, you have to get. Sounds Sandra. good. Mark Meredith on that for us. I'm Steve Ducey. I'm Brian Kilmeade. And I'm Ainsley Earhart. And click here to subscribe to the Fox News YouTube page to catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis.